These are also some other Shana applications, um, not just for fun, but to build your knowledge of self-defense. So a lot of these things can be translated into if somebody's trying to grab you, for example, they put their arms on you and you just don't want to be bothered, or if you're even in combat situation and you happen to turn and rotate outwards, okay? Because a lot of times if you have, and in Kung Fu, you wind up fighting people who know long fist or something like that, and they have a tendency to leave their body open. So this is a way of being able to be creative with an application. So we do it from a standstill so that you can get the principle of motion. Okay, but what you need to do is you've got to be understanding if somebody's punching you this way. So for even in a lot of Tai Chi arts, if you're doing like push hands, you have openings like this. And this is a way of being able to do a Shana application on something like that. So keep an open mind when you're doing things. We're going to do it from a stationary position so you get the principle of motion. Lao Shir Chris is my opponent, and we will begin. We're going to do this because it's a long fist or a variation of how to defend against long fist. She's going to wind up putting her arm on this side. So what I'm doing, the first motion, is I'm taking my hand of the body that's on the side and coming up. My opposite hand is pinching on the, on the grabbing her hand on the shoulder, so I'm just pinching it. Then I'm just rotating over. It's an elbow wrap, and I wind up doing, grabbing the fingers here, turning them out, pressing forward, and I'm pressing down on this. So what we'll do on her, on her elbow. So she's reaching out and grabbing. I'm grabbing, I'm pinching it here, coming up, which is lifting. As you can see, it lifts her uh, shoulder, so it compromises her structure. Once that's up, I, am, uh, I can overturn. I can just rotate my body over. And then I'm pinching, putting pressure right here on the elbow, twisting this, and almost like turning a doorknob. And it actually puts a lot of pressure on the joint. And then I'm able to control that. Say so one more time, just for fluidity's sake, she's going. Good. All right. 